Are you saying uh, once you get this current uh, agenda passed on uh, spending and social programs that you would be open to fundamentally altering the, the filibuster or, or doing away with the, or doing away with it? Well, that remains to be seen exactly what that means in terms of fundamentally altering it, <clears throat> whether or not we just end the filibuster straight up. Well, that is a Jim Dandy idea there. Yeah. Hey, howdy. Okay, everybody's saying, <laughs> why isn't the White House spoken out about the filibuster? There it is. Mm. The president went on to say. Um, there are certain things that are just sacred rights. One's a sacred obligation that we're never going to renege on a debt. We're the only nation in the world. <clears throat> we have never, ever reneged on a single debt. But when it comes to voting rights... Voting rights you, is equally as consequential. When it comes to voting rights, just so I'm clear, though, you would entertain the notion of doing away with the filibuster on that one issue? Is that correct? And maybe more. And maybe other issues. All right. Seems like a popular idea. By the way, POTUS was fantastic last night at the uh, CNN town hall. Yep. Right? Oh, like I thought I couldn't love him anymore. Did you read the breaking news, the story that he's a bit of a potty mouth in private? Not shocking. That is... He can go work on the docks with you. Yes. He can go help out at the yeah. Port of L.A. here yeah. with me. You and Malcolm. It is amazing the stories they write as if there's some... I, really? He swears in private? Oh, that is uh-huh. shocking. <laughs> really? Let's do that seat. Really? Okay. Love him even more. Makes him even more relatable. But thank you for making that, a, I don't know, some kind of gotcha story. He says it. They're like hall monitors now. He says the F word sometimes in private. So does everybody else in right. the world. Yes, right. And A, right. Mm-hmm. What? Sometimes you say it on the air. Right? <laughs>